Good afternoon, this is Kate reporting with Gator Vision. Standing with me today, head coach Roland Thornquist. Roland, I understand you got two girls heading to New York for the national indoors, and then the rest of the team headed down to the Dick Vitale tournament. Tell me a little bit about how you finish up this fall and get ready to go into January with these two big tournaments. Well, we've played a lot of matches this fall, which is nice. We, we get to see pretty much everybody play at least four events. And so we've learned a lot about the freshmen. And uh, this week will be sort of the culmination of uh, a lot of work in the fall. And two players go play fast indoors, and the other five slow on clay. And so it's a little bit different uh, for the two, um, you know, different segments going going one north and one south. But uh, indoors, it's a Grand Slam event for us. Sophie, both Sophie and Alex have been there before, and so they know what to expect. The best players in the country are going to be there, and. Um, it's a great atmosphere at the Billie Jean King Tennis Center. Uh, on the other hand, down south, I think the field there is about as tough as it's ever been. And our players know that uh, they have to play well to advance. We have five players play in that draw. And so we we're, we're feel that it's probably likely that we'll have some teammates play one another again, which has happened more than once already this fall. And we just need to handle that with class and play hard, but um, you know, show great sportsmanship. Great. And then also just talk a little bit about what you're looking forward to the break, um, what you're telling the girls to prepare for coming into the season coming up in January. Well, our strength coach, uh, Tyler, is uh, doing our st the, the off-season strength and running schedule for us now. And so some players will lift more than run, and some players will run more than lift. We're going to individualize it for them. And, but if you look at the schedule, we really don't have that many weeks to work. Uh, Thanksgiving is sneaking up on us here, and then – we have maybe one week after that, and then uh, we're in final exams. And so uh, usually what we do is uh, slow down a little bit with our players now and tell them that we're relying on them to do some work at home over Christmas. And that's a chance for them to get ahead. A lot of players take off Christmas. And if our players want to do well on an individual as well as uh, uh, on a team level in the spring, uh, we're going to rely on, on – uh, them taking ownership of their own game over Christmas. So I think that uh, that's usually how we do it, and it's both uh, been been good for us in the past. Wonderful. And have you seen the draw yet for the national indoors for Sophie and Alex? I know it's a really obviously competitive uh, tournament. Have you seen who they're going up against yet? I have not. No, we'll look at that uh, tomorrow. Maybe we're going to get up there, and we're going to try to hit a little bit tonight up there, and then uh, we have another hit tomorrow and a banquet. So it'll be some socializing before, but then come Thursday morning, it'll be all business. Great. Well, we wish you the best of luck in both places. Go Gators. Standing with me, I have Sophie Oyen and Alex Sircone, two seniors of the women's tennis team, headed to the New York to the National Indoor Championships. Uh, Sophie, Alex, I know you both have played here before. Sophie, you had a great run last year. How do you prepare at the end of your fall season to go up um, to New York to a big competition like this? Well, obviously we are practicing indoors because we're playing indoors. Um, the courts are really fast um, there, and you know I love to play indoors, so um, we just practice like we always do, and we just um, are going to practice tonight, tomorrow, and then we'll see what happens. Great, and Alex, obviously um, New York, it's cold, it's exciting. Are you excited just to kind of be there? I know this is a fun event, and you've got like a welcoming ceremony and things like that. Are you excited to see some of your friends that you might have played against and things like that? Absolutely. I'm super excited to go to New York. I found out I was going. I was thrilled. Um, we have like a banquet tomorrow where we get to see, you know, the inside of Arthur Ashe Stadium, so that's going to be really special. And also seeing all my friends from other schools is um really great uh, and don't get many opportunities to see them so I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Great and we just talked to Roland a little bit about how you prepare for yourself during the break. I know you don't have that much time but around Christmas time how are you to preparing to stay in shape and get ready for the January season which is coming up so soon? So I'm going home for a month um, during Christmas break and I basically practice almost every day uh, except the weekend. Um, I can train at the Federation with good girls um, so uh, we'll do some physical stuff, some tennis, and then I'll be ready in January. Great. And Alex, coming to your senior year, how about you? This is the final push. Are you ready? Um, what are you doing to preparing for the spring season coming up? Um, yeah, I mean, pretty much the same as Sophie. I'm going to be home a majority of the time. Might actually meet up with Lauren Embry, fellow skater, and practice with her. 
Um, so yeah, just going to travel around and get good practices in and try to be as prepared as I can for when season starts up in January. Thanks, girls. Good luck. Stay warm up in New York, and we wish you the best. Go, Go Gators. Gators.